back to another YouTube video. My name is Lauren. If you're new, today's video is going to be a productive video, getting ready for the work week, meal prepping, restocking on all of our groceries from Costco, Trader Joe's, Publix, all of the things, laundry, cleaning. I already have laundry going in the washer and dryer as you saw. I need to go to multiple different grocery stores today and restock on everything. I'm going to be meal prepping today for the week. So I'm going to be doing that. Got some stuff from Amazon and I'm really going to film an Amazon favorites video. I mentioned that multiple videos ago that I was going to be doing an Amazon favorites and I just haven't gotten around to it. There's a lot of noise going on, but I'm going to be filming an Amazon favorites video. I promise it's coming soon, but I got a few things from Amazon. This. Got some claw clips and then I got a new tripod. The tripod that you're on is not taken too well. And I really do like this tripod. It was 20 bucks, so it's not expensive. And what I like about it too is you can use it for taking photos because it comes with a little remote that connects to your phone. This is what it looks like. It comes with all this stuff. It comes with a little travel bag. and So it's for iPhone and Android users. Yeah, just wanted to show you what I got. I just got home from Costco and I thought I'd do a quick haul before I left to go to Trader Joe's. This is new. We just picked this up. I saw it on the end of an aisle and <laughs> these are incredible so I wanted to pick them up. These almond flour tortillas, we've been doing quesadillas, breakfast quesadillas on the weekends and we went through a full pack of them already and they're so good so I got more of those. Eggs, I get our eggs most of the time from Costco, so I got more eggs, chicken, that come vacuum seals, I've spoke about them a million times. These crackers, they're really good in dips on their own, so I got more of those. Salmon, got two packages of salmon and we vacuum seal this. And meal prepping something different this week for lunches, so I got guacamole to go with it and they're individually packaged. So I got those. I got some Boom Chicka Pop kettle corn. This is a huge bag. It's like the size of my arm. It's really good. Stuffed peppers. These are incredible and they reheat pretty well as well. It takes about an hour to cook, but something pretty easy. All you do is just put it in the oven and it's done in an hour. I got a bunch of ground turkey. I'm switching up the meats for our meal prep. So I got some ground turkey, I got two packages, and then I got some ground beef as well, and then paper towels. So that is the Costco haul, and now I'm gonna put it all away, and then we will go to Trader Joe's. Okay, I just got home from Trader Joe's. I'm doing a little Trader Joe's haul. So I'll start over here. Got more avocado spray, got two of those. I got these non-crackers. I got three of the 
everything but the elote chips. They're, they're so good and we go through them really quickly. So I got three of those. I got black beans. I'm doing taco salad bowls with rice and beans and corn and all that for lunches for the week. So I got two cans of black beans. Found this New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc wine. Our friend Sam, she was talking about this wine to me and she said it's really good. So I'm excited to try it. Got these ice cream sandwiches. Christian loves those. Got two containers of the center cut filet. They have really good center cut filet. So we vacuum seal this and have it every so often. Parmesan cheese. Got the roasted corn. This is gonna be for our lunches for the week as well. Artichoke and jalapeno dip. This is really good with those crackers that I mentioned and bought today from Costco. Ginger shots, got four of those. Chunky guacamole, that's really good with the everything but the elote chips. Got these gratin potatoes. Thought it'd be really good with steak or just as a side. They look really yummy, never tried them. Gorgonzola gnocchi, this is really good. Got one of those. Orange chicken and fried rice. Easy dinner, super good. I got these, they were really cheap. They were 99 cents. They're hot cocoa stirring spoons with mini marshmallows, so you just put it in a hot cup of milk and you stir it in there and it turns into hot cocoa. So I thought this was fun, so I got two of those. Got this Syrah cheese. I tried this like a month and a half ago on a grilled cheese and it's so good. So I got another one of those. Sourdough bread, Trader Joe's has the best sourdough bread. Almond butter almonds, I got three of these. They're one of our favorite snacks, they're so good. I got eucalyptus to hang in the shower. It was like $3. And I've been wanting to try hanging it in the shower, so I got some of that for that. And then this, I follow a Trader Joe's account on Instagram, and she was showing all of the advent calendars that Trader Joe's has, and this was one of them. They're super cheap, I think they're 99 cents. So I'm excited to have this for the month of December. I think it'd be really fun. I've actually never had one of these before. So I thought it'd be something fun, so I got one of those. But that is the Trader Joe's haul, so I'm gonna put everything away. And then I'm gonna run to Publix to pick up the last bit of the stuff that we need for the week. I don't know if you can see, but they started hanging up the Christmas decorations in the trees. I'm so excited for the holidays. about to begin prepping dinner. It takes about two hours. It's a crock pot cheddar chili mac and cheese. It's by no means healthy, but it sounds really good. You don't need a lot of ingredients and it takes two hours. So I'll let you guys know how it is. everything in the crock pot and this is what it looks like. I'm gonna cook it on low for two hours. 
I'm gonna sprinkle the cheddar cheese on top and let that cook for an hour and then it says to mix it up halfway through. So after an hour, I'm gonna mix it up and then let it cook for the remaining hour. While the crock pot cheddar chili mac and cheese is cooking, I'm gonna start meal prepping our lunches for the week. So this is what I'm doing. It's gonna be ground turkey and I'm gonna use taco seasoning packets, the roasted corn that I got today from Trader Joe's, black beans. I'm gonna do half spinach, half leaf lettuce, guacamole, and then some jasmine rice. And that will be our lunches for the week. So I'll show you guys the finished product when I'm done, but I'm gonna start prepping this right now. Okay, here is the meal prep for the week. I put the guacamole back in the fridge, but that's included as well. Like a salad mixture with tomatoes, black beans, rice, corn, and ground turkey with the taco seasoning on it. So this is the finished product. It's really good, I've had it before, and it holds really well, and reheats really well through all four days, so that's why I like to do it as well. Now I'm gonna put all this away, do the dishes, unload the dishwasher, and clean off the counters. probably thinking you're like Lauren why are you in the car again I have a good reason I know that I was cooking that chili mac and cheese and I'm gonna have some of that when I get home and we're gonna have the leftovers tomorrow for dinner so I'm not it's not going to waste at all but I'm going to get takeout sushi with my two best friends Taylor and Maya so Christian's gonna have the chili mac and cheese for dinner and then we're gonna have it again tomorrow night so it's it's not gonna go to waste I'm obviously gonna eat it and I'll link the recipe down below in case you guys want to try it and I'll also put my rating on the screen of what I rate it if it's good or not I'll obviously let you guys know but um, yeah I'm going to get sushi with them well Maya's picking up the sushi from this place called Nona sushi it's in Lake Nona and bringing it to us she says it's one of the best sushi places that she knows of so I'm really excited to try it I've never tried it before I just got a shrimp tempura roll and a spicy tuna roll which are my two go-to rolls but yeah that's what I'm doing and I just want to say I was beating myself up a little bit like a few minutes ago because there was just so many more things that I wanted to do today that I didn't get done. If you guys struggle with this, trying to just do all the things and always just needing to be doing something, and I hope you guys realize you don't need to accomplish everything every single day and every day doesn't need to be a productive day. It's how you get burnt out and I'm so guilty of this. 
I am constantly like trying to just do so much I fill my plate with things and I'm I never sit still and I'm always just doing something and I get burnt out really easily so I just was like beating myself up over like not getting it done but I like took a look at my whole day and I said you did so much today like don't beat yourself up over not getting everything done because there's not enough hours in the day and there's not enough hours in the day for a reason so just learn when to shut it off and shut it down and relax because I have a problem with that and I need to take that advice too but today was such a productive day and now I'm super excited to have sushi and then get home at a decent hour and go to bed early <laughs> I don't know, I haven't even watched Okay, I just got home a little bit ago, showered. That eucalyptus in the shower is so nice. It's incredible. Um, I'm going to do some skincare. I just wanted to go ahead and end off this video. By the way, I did try that macaroni and cheese chili or whatever. It was really good. It was, I read it like a seven. I'll have it for dinner tomorrow. But I thought it was pretty good. And Christian rated it like a little bit over a seven. So he liked it too. But I'll link the recipe down below as I mentioned before. And um, yeah. But I'm gonna finish doing my skincare. And I wanted to go ahead and end off this video. I wanna try and be in bed before 9 40 or like asleep before 9 40 and it's 9 15 so i'm hoping that that happens so i hope you guys enjoyed this productive vlog i know when i watch these i'm inspired to get stuff done do laundry clean up get organized so i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure you're subscribed give this video a thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next video bye